Richard with SoCal Thrills, and we're here today at Medieval Times Dinner and Tournament in Buena Park. We will be taking a backstage tour of the castle and also meeting two key individuals that help put the show together. back behind the stables. We are here with Greta, who is the head trainer. How long have you been here with the company? I've been with Medieval Times. This year will be the seventh year. September will be seven years. How long does it take to actually train one of these horses before they're placed into the show? Well, the horses have like a specific job in the show. It depends what they do, what kind of job we sign for them. Some of them, they do like the work we call the joust. They just run back and forth with the knights. That takes maybe a couple months at the most. And then we have what we call the solo act, which is the high school. It can take between one year to up to three, four years. So it depends what we want to train the horse, because the training doesn't have limit, it's a skylight. And since we are, we do have a horse here, what is its name? Well, this guy's name is Han Aderon. He's a Spanish horse. And actually he does the hind leg walk. He get up and he walk on his hand leg. Yeah, he does all the type of sit, uh, the tricks. He sits, uh, he bow one leg, two legs, uh, the Spanish walk. Yeah, yeah, he's the, one of the highest, highest trained horse we have. If you were here at Medieval Times and your role was not as lead horse trainer, what would be your next ideal role? Here in Medieval Times? Mm -hmm. As long as I'm working with the horses, I can work stable hands. I can be, as long as I'm, I'm in, inter interacting with the horses, I would be happy. And I'm lucky, of course, I am, I'm in charge of these horses, I look after them, I'm the guy, you know, uh, to train them, and it's, it's just like, I think I'm, I'm really lucky. Wow, thank you so much. We're here with Jesse, who is the head knight here. Jesse, how long have you been here with Medieval Times? Um, going on eight years. Now, as a head knight, what are your roles and duties here? Uh, I'm in charge of training uh, the guys back here, uh, training apprentice knights, training knights, uh, helping training on horses, so getting horses into jousting, into combat. Uh, sometimes they're a little greener, uh, at least saddle broken. But as far as an environment like this, uh, they're not really used to it, so it takes a little while. You want someone who's athletic. Uh, it's a very physical job. Uh, the the fights span anywhere from two minutes to three minutes per fight, uh, depending on which one. And it's like sprinting. Out of all the different competitions that happen during the tournament, what is your favorite? Favorite competition? Uh, as far as the games portion, hmm. The small ring is definitely the most challenging one. Everything else is relatively easy. Um, the small ring is only like that big, um, and it's with our lance, which is eight feet. So it's kind of difficult to aim and target on that one. That one's the most challenging one. We have an espada, a little smaller, a little lighter. That's a single-handed weapon. We also have a horseback, which is slightly smaller than that one you would use when you're on a horse. Yeah, and you can see this one hasn't gotten any attention to it lately, so you can see all these burrs, they'll really get chewed up. Then you got our shields, like I said, these are our fully functional metal. This one's a little heavy. So yeah, as you can see, this one was ground down not too long ago. So it only has a few layers of paint, but when the, when the paint breaks away, it'll start to chip away and you'll see it. So this one's actually in pretty good condition. Every now and again, the handles will break in here, just from pressure being thrown or stepped on or whatever.
All right, guys. So if you happen to be here at Medieval Times in Buena Park and you happen to be in the green section, it may be Jesse. Thank you guys so much for joining us on this behind the scenes tour of Medieval Times Dinner and Tournament in Buena Park and we'll see you guys real soon.